So here we are at the New York Times R&D Lab. We're a small lab focused on cultural, sociological, uh, technical changes that might impact um, the way we use, find, or share information. What we're talking about right now is uh, one of our newer prototypes called the listening table. We designed this augmented object to basically hear and understand the conversations that are had around it. The table has speech recognition functions built in. As you can see, the transcription is pretty good. Um, if I were to say, uh, I don't know, some weird product names or neologisms, we probably wouldn't be able to get them, but it got neologism, so I'm impressed with that. Right now you can see the LEDs are reacting to my voice. Under this container we have um, a dynamic microphone array uh, and that allows it to position speech to figure out who's talking. Um, these uh, uh, rectangles here are capacitive touch strips. So this is a Corian surface and these are enameled steel. You see when I touch them this blinks and so this is how anyone drops a marker during a meeting. So a way to say uh, that moment was important and I'm just going to drop a marker right there. So now you can see that markers showed up and that way I can review that moment instead of the entire transcript. And then we can see along the side uh, there are these little single pixel thermal cameras and that's just to detect who's sitting where. Underneath is uh, pretty, pretty spare except for the one switch and all that does is let people turn it off. One of the things that we thought about really from the, from the beginning of this project was the, the concerns that people have around privacy, around this age where more and more devices are able to listen continuously. So the Amazon Echo, the Moto X, other devices now sort of by default are listening and understanding speech. And we wanted to um, offer our version of that as a much more thoughtful approach to this that allows the people in the room to be best served by the technology. So for example, the database where all of the, all of the meetings are stored is actually right inside the table. There's no cloud to trust. Um, and the database has a rolling window of forgetting, so it's enforced uh, forgetting. It, after 28 days, um, everything in the database uh, goes away. So it's the circular window of just the last 28 days. And that's one of the many factors that we put in to make us comfortable with having it around. We wanted to make an object that was from a future we wanted to live in.